Today's Hollyback News video covers the fascinating story of Yu Hao Ming and Selena from Xi, both actors in China who were burned on set in 2010. But before I get into the story, you guys gotta check out Steph. That is Steph out there right now experiencing the solar eclipse which is happening. It's about 2.40 in the afternoon. She's got some little thing that she made there. I'm not sure what it is, but she's prepping for tonight's Twitch stream, solar eclipse themed. And she looks so pretty in the garden. Follow stuff on Twitch. Thanks you guys for your support. Boys Over Flowers is possibly the most popular drama ever to air in Asia, and they've made it in different countries. They've made it in Taiwan, they've made it in Japan, they've made it in Korea, and they made it in China, as well as other versions that we won't talk about. Before I get into the details of what happened to the accident, the reason why this is coming up back in the news now is because Yu Hao Ming is making a comeback in 2017 into dramas. The version that was made in China was in 2009, which was the same year of the version that was made in Korea. The Chinese and Taiwanese versions of Boys Over Flowers are called Meteor Shower. Yu Hao Ming played the second lead, a member of the F4 and the son of a doctor, overall nice if not odd guy, who the lead actress's character was in love with in the beginning beginning of the drama. At the time, Yu Hao Ming was a Chinese mando pop singer who debuted in 2007 in a singing competition called Superboy. A year after Boys Over Flowers in 2010, there was a drama that he was starring in called I Have a Date with Spring. He had a huge role opposite the very famous Chinese idol Selena from Xi, kind of like China's 21. And on October 22nd, 2010, while filming in Shanghai, there was an accidental explosion during an indoor shooting. He suffered third degree burns over approximately 40% of his body, including on his face, and his acting partner, Selena, suffered 54% of her body burning, but the damage on her body was focused mostly on her back and legs. Three months later, she was discharged from the hospital in January of 2011, and she had a press conference where she was warmly recepted. It does look like her face got hit a little bit with burns, but it didn't affect her front features too much. I mean, she was able to make a comeback only about three months after the accident took place. And she even dropped a new album later that year in 2011. Yu Hao Ming, on the other hand's story is a little bit different. He injured his face and he didn't work for years. He's not really doing the singing thing anymore either. And he has focused on doing films since the accident with small roles and supporting actor parts. He did two in 2014 and in 2017 this year, he's making his big comeback despite him only having supporting actor parts in two films, one called Youth Dinner, another one called Nothing Gold Can Stay, and then a third project that he's working on called Tribes and Empires, Storm of Prophecy, which is still in the works. I was chatting with Steph a little bit about this story specifically, and she was saying how even though the accident affected both actors, Selena and Yu Hao Ming, Yu Hao Ming kind of got the short end of the stick because of where the burns took place on his body. Like even though Selena did get hit a little bit in the face, it wasn't enough to affect her appearance to the point where she was, I guess, perceived by the public as disfigured or somewhat disfigured. And she was able to carry on and almost embraced even more because of the accident by the general public. At the time of the accident, Yu Hao Ming also very much was a top actor in China doing lead roles only. Now, seven years later, he's making the comeback, but only with supporting roles or secondary roles. So that's where the unfairness of the situation comes in because I think his face was hit more and therefore allowing the public to perceive what happened in a different way or just the public being reminded that that happened to him because you can visually see that it did. This is an awful tragedy that happened to both of these actors. If you look at Yu Hao Ming's Wikipedia, I mean, this is really the defining mo moment of his career. I guess that just means in life, no matter what, you gotta work hard for what you want and you can never take anything for granted. Comments, you guys, about Yu Hao Ming and Selena. Did you hear about this in 2010 when it happened? Or only more recently when this came up in the news? And how do you feel after hearing the story of the Burns and then him and both of them making their comebacks and the results being different? Click the like button. Thank you for supporting us. Click the bell for notifications. Check out the link to KGAL and don't forget to subscribe for more Hollywood back news. That's it. I'm out of here. Hasta luego.